Yeah, welcome to PSLE Max. Let's look at a question from 2020 prelims paper, Anglo-Chinese School. This is question number 15. Mrs. Tan bought some forks and spoons in the ratio 4 is to 3. Each spoon cost 50 cents more than each fork. She spent a total of $156 on the forks and spoons. The amount she spent on the forks was $12 more than the amount she spent on the spoons. Part of the question is how much did she spend on the spoons? She spent a total of $156 on forks and spoons and she spent $12 more on spoons. So let's subtract that $12. The remaining is $144 which is equally spent on forks and spoons. So $144 divided by 2 is equal to $72. So she spent $72 on the spoons. So that's the answer to part A of the question. And $72 plus the $12 is equal to $84 is what she spent on the forks. So we know that she bought forks and spoons in the ratio 4 is to 3. The amount of money she spent on 4 parts of forks is $84. So per part would be $84 divided by 4 is equal to $21. Similarly, she spent $72 on 3 parts of spoons. So per part would be $72 divided by 3 is equal to $24. So $24 minus $21 which is equal to $3 is the amount of money she has spent more on one part of spoons than on one part of forks. But we know that the cost of one spoon is 50 cents more than one fork. So that's $3 divided by 50 cents is equal to 6 forks or spoons in each part. Part B of the question is how many forks and spoons did she buy altogether? So the total number of parts is 4 parts forks and 3 parts spoons. So that's a total of 7 parts and each part has 6 fork or spoons. So that's 6 times 7 is equal to 42 forks and spoons altogether. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe to this channel for more problem sums. If you have a specific question that you would like to see a video on, please post it in the comment section. Thank you.